Petroleum refineries in the United States are working continuously on reducing their emissions and improving the ambient air quality. Many refineries are already monitoring the air quality in and around their facilities. Now a new EPA regulation has been introduced which compels petroleum refineries in the US to measure the concentration of benzene along the fence line and in the event of limit values being exceeded, demands that further actions should be taken. The Petrochem Refining Rule for Benzene Fence Line Monitoring, implemented in January of 2016, requires that all refining facilities must have a program in place to not only monitor, but also report benzene emissions by January 2018. <laughs> Many refineries still lack a system for fence line monitoring of benzene emissions. Therefore, it is high time to make a start. According to the new regulation, the monitoring system needs to be installed and operating by January 30th, 2018, at the very latest. In order to save both time and money, it is crucial to get it right from the outset. In this short video, we will attempt to show you what is important to bear in mind. Firstly, it is essential to have a reliable system for carrying out the measurement process in the correct way. EPA has evaluated a range of measuring methods and concluded that there are only two that work in this application. Method 325 and UV doers. UV doers has proven to be the perfect technology for fence line monitoring of benzene. With UV doers, it is possible to make advanced analysis for finding the sources of fugitive emissions. This provides the basis for action if a limit value is exceeded. We shall be looking into this in closer detail later, but first, let's take a closer look at the basics of the UV doers technology. UV DOAS is a well-proven monitoring technology that allows the measurement of gaseous concentrations by the use of a beam of light to detect gases across an open path and subsequently analyse the result. An emitter is placed at one end of a monitoring path which continuously emits light towards a receiver located at the other end. The receiver collects and transfers the light signal to the analyzer. The analyzer measures, calculates and forwards the results to designated recipients. The measurements are continuous and in real time. Should there be a release of benzene, it is registered instantly. By incorporating several emitters and receivers, the entire fence line can be monitored regardless of the size of the refinery. OPSIS is world leading in UV DOAS monitoring technology and has thousands of systems in operation in the US and the rest of the world. OPSIS UV DOAS monitoring systems are installed at refineries that now, as a result, have much better control of their fugitive emissions of benzene and can start reporting data in accordance to the new regulation. And according to the regulation, the corrected annual rolling average of benzene should not exceed 9 micrograms per cubic metre. Therefore, it is of vital importance that the monitoring system is accurate. OPSIS UV DOAS system has superior measurement performance. The OPSIS UV DOAS system is very accurate. It has certification for a range of 0 to 10 micrograms per cubic meter of benzene. The measured relative accuracy at 9 micrograms per cubic meter is less than 2%. OPSIS UV DOAS system is superior in many ways and it is also very cost effective. The OPSIS UV DOAS system is a cost effective solution long term due to its low annual maintenance cost. The low annual maintenance cost is attributed to the long service and calibration interval. 
Another great benefit with the Opsis UV DOAS system is that it measures in real time. This is a necessary quality in order to make advanced analyses, to find fugitive emission sources and to be able to take urgent measurements if and when necessary. The Opsis UV DOAS provides data in real time, which allows the refinery to correlate the results to the wind conditions, to pinpoint the source and to take quick action. The monitoring data can be used for simulation purposes and for generating different sorts of charts. This is an example of what a dispersion chart can look like in the event of emissions occurring in a facility. The system shows directly where the emission source is located. The dispersion chart also shows if the source of emission is further afield from a different facility. OPSIS UV DOAS system is cost-effective as it requires a minimum of resources for operation. OPSIS also offers a complete solution where the customer receives the final data and need not be involved in operating the actual instrumentation. Another solution to the benzene fence line monitoring is the OPSIS Build Own Operate program. This program allows OPSIS and its partners to own, operate, and maintain the fence line monitoring system and deliver reports directly to the customer. By January 30th, 2018, all petroleum refineries in the U.S. will be required to measure putative benzene emissions along the fence line of the facility. The best way to do this is by incorporating an OPSIS UV DOA system. The result being a system with superior accuracy and one that is cost effective and measures the levels of benzene in real time, which is a must in order to reduce emissions over the long term and to be able to take the proper course of action in the event of a sudden incident. Contact OPSIS for more information about the UV DOAS benzene fence line monitoring for refineries.